So, you think you've forgotten your sudo password for the Steam Deck? Well, the first question you've got to ask yourself is, did you ever set one in the first place? The chances are the answer is no. So all you need to do is come into desktop mode, go to the settings, users, and set one for your user. By default, the Steam Deck does not have a sudo password set or a password for the default user profile. So all you need to do is come in and set one. And if you get a confirmation straight away and go into change wallet password, then that is all you need to do. Now, whatever you need that sudo password for, you have just set and you can go and use freely. However, if you have done this previously, as you come to change your sudo password and then you get a secondary authorization, then you have previously set your sudo password and potentially have forgotten it. Now, if you cannot use the same password that you just set to authorize the change password and you get this authentication failure message, then you are in a bit of trouble, just like I was. So what you need to do is shut down your Steam Deck and switch over to a Windows PC and start the recovery process. Now you will need the Steam Deck recovery image, which I'll link in the description below. And you'll also need a USB stick or memory card, as well as the Rufus software on Windows. You've got other versions on Linux. Once you've downloaded that ISO image, you want to use Rufus to stick that recovery image onto the SD card or device that you got plugged in. If you're using a USB hard drive, tick the list USB hard drive box to make sure that you can see the device. Then just use the default settings that you've got here for that recovery image and hit start. Now this one takes a fair amount of time, it takes between five and 10 minutes, depending on the write speed of your device. So just let that complete until it hits 100%. Once that's done, you need to boot your Steam Deck into the bootloader. To do this, press and hold the power button and the minus button as you turn it on. And as you hear the beep or the boot up sound, take your finger off the power button, but keep it on the minus button. Select your USB stick to boot from, and you'll boot up into the Steam Deck recovery mode. Once in the recovery mode, you need to run some commands on console. I'll link directly to this post, but make sure you give a thumbs up to Fine Wolf on Reddit for giving us this quick and easy fix. You need to copy and paste these three commands one by one. Don't copy them all in one go, run them each one line at a time, otherwise you'll hit problems. Because once you've done all three of these, then you just need to reboot your Steam Deck. This just clears out the sudo password on your Steam Deck. And now you can go back into desktop mode and set the user as we were trying to do at the start. And you'll notice this time you don't get that confirmation and you can now set the wallet password at the same time. There you have it. If you didn't set a sudo password, it's very quick and easy to do. And if you've forgotten it, you now have a way to reset it without wiping your Steam Deck. Let us know in the comments below if this has helped you and you'll probably wonder why you needed this in the first place if you're still here. Well, if you bought an M2 dock, you'll soon find out. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.